I love the story of the very hungry caterpillar. Um, that caterpillar inspired our sightword caterpillar, by the way. And so um, it also showed like the days of the week in it. So that's why I showed it to you for this next lesson because we're going to take our, um, in our calendar math book, we're gonna open it and flip it. So yesterday was day 10, so today is day 11. And we're going to start at the bottom here and take our pencil and write a one and a one. That's going to show day 11, okay? Um, and then we're going to then take out our September calendar. Okay, go ahead and open that up. Um, so yesterday we wrote the number 14. Today we're going to write the number 15. Okay, so trace the one and the five here. Okay, and then notice that the 15 come, if you work your way up, that, that today is a Tuesday. It'll show that yesterday was Monday, and if you look here, then tomorrow is Wednesday. All right, so we're gonna need that. But first, we have to go to this page and catch up here. So we have 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. We get to put a circle here to show 15, okay? All right, we're, we have more days in September, so we're not gonna write anything here. But here, and let's look at our tally marks, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. This is where you get to put a slide now for 15, okay? So that's done. Now you're showing 15 days in the month of September. Okay, so I'm gonna flip up, and I can tell the ones that have exit tickets on it, those have been all filled in. So let me find, ah, here's my next blank page, okay. So let's go to the top and do our seasons. Is it winter right now? No. Is, is it spring? No. Is it summer? Yes. Is it fall? Not yet, but that'll be next. Okay, so we know that today is Tuesday, so that means yesterday was not Sunday, but Monday. Yesterday was Monday. Today is Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, which means tomorrow will be the next day, which Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, after Tuesday comes Wednesday. Okay, let's, let's find our month. Not January, not February, not March, not April, not May, not June, not July, not August. Yes, September. So we're going to write our date. And our date is right here, September 15th. So we're going to write capital S, I'm copying from right there, E, P, T, E, M, E, E, R, and that's a name, which is why you have a capital letter. I'll put my finger space, and I'll put my one and my five, 15, and then my comma, a sideways smile, and then a finger space, 2000, two zero. Two zero is how we write 2020. And now you know the secret in kindergarten of friendly tens. You can even put little smiley faces in your zeros because you know that those zeros, oh, there it is right there, sorry if you didn't see that. I put little smiley faces in my zeros because the zeros show us when we have friendly tens, okay? All right, give yourself an exit ticket at the top of the page. Great job, boys and girls.